Hello again. Yep, here I am. Got my new hat on. Longer peak. It's another miserable one today though, I'm afraid. Let me show you. Very similar to uh, yesterday. Got to keep the wind blocker on, but not quite as windy. It's raining, but not quite enough to completely say we're not going anywhere. Which kind of thwarts my plans a little bit. You see, according to the weather forecast, it was supposed to be absolutely coming down torrential today. And uh, tomorrow, Sunday, was supposed to be really nice. So what I was going to do was just to stick my head out today in the rain and use some footage that I shot in Newton Abbott. But as you can see, it's not as bad as I suspected, although it is getting a little bit worse as I walk. Angry seas. Oh, blowing a gale up here. I hope I don't lose my new hat. It's got a longer peak to keep the liquid sunshine off my glasses, see? Here we go, I'll hold the phone still. Possibly the only train of the day. Is there no way I'm risking walking to that wall again like I tried to do yesterday? That was a complete failure. So I learned from my mistakes. I am, however, going to walk just a little way along here, just to these steps. So I've got another whalebone picture. Now, regulars have seen a few pictures of the whale bones and know what I'm talking about, but new people might not. So just down here, at the end of this little walkway, where the uh, two stone pillars and the steps are ahead of me, there used to be a set of whale bones. And at the other end, by the teeth bean as well, but that's another story. And uh, another picture came up the other night. So I thought I'd show that. Here we go, the whale bones. there aren't they even if it's changed angle a little bit but the uh the stone pillars are still the same lovely well with that i've been blasted all up underneath my hat now and my glasses and the rain is indeed picking up so what i think i'm going to do is to use a little bit of the content I shot in Newton Abbott when I went over to the dentist the other day. Now it's not hugely exciting, I wasn't going over there to make a video, I wasn't going over there with loads of then and nows or anything like that. I was just going to the dentist. But I did do a bit of filming, I ended up with eight minutes. I'll tell you what, I'll show you the first part of it from before I went into the dentist. So you see me going over, the fun and games at the station, and uh, getting to the dentist, and I'll show you the rest tomorrow, in tomorrow's video. Here we go. Hello again, it's the afternoon. Got to go over to my dentist. It's the 5th, I think. The 5th of March, off to the dentist. Grab some tickets from the ticket machine. I expect they'd like me to pay, so I will. That was quite funny. I said uh, jokingly about, I expect they want me to buy a ticket. I went to the machine, tried it, and it couldn't connect to take my payment. So I tried it again, it couldn't connect. So I went inside and saw the lady in the little booth. I said, um, Return to Newton Abbey, your machine won't connect. She said, no, our machines won't connect, the whole system's down. And I said, oh, right, OK. I said, well, I've got a £20 note here in my wallet, I'll pay with that. She said, no, 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 the whole system's down. I can't sell you a ticket. Blimey, that's a new one. She said, so how do I get to Newton Abbot? I've got a dentist appointment. She said, well, you just have to buy the ticket on the train. Oh, OK, fair enough. But the fun is going to be when I get to Newton Abbot, trying to get out the other end. Great Western Railway service to Paynton is delayed by approximately six minutes. Oh. This is due to a fault on this train. A fault on the train, yeah, they can't sell tickets, that's a fault. Oh well, never mind. Watch this one come through instead. Whee! Well, that was good. I just got approached by a chap on the platform who works here. Says, are you the guy looking to buy a ticket when we were down? I said, yeah, that's right. And he said, well, we're back up again. So I've gone to the lady at the desk and got my two tickets. Now I've just got to make sure the train arrives. <laughs>
Here he comes, eventually. This is mine. Right, don't know if I'll be at a window seat or not to film. We just have to see. If not, I'll see you in Newton Abbott. Here we are, Newton Abbott. I didn't film on the way over because I suspected it was a very busy train. I couldn't get a, a window seat. There we are, Newton Abbott. In the sunshine. Even better. There's my dentist. I've got 25 minutes to go. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get down to Sports Direct to get the baseball cap I want to pick up, or I'll have to do it later, but I'll start walking down and see how the time goes. Now, I've decided against going down there now. I'll see what I can do when I come out, because I don't want to get down there and find I'm getting messed about with these vouchers I've got and end up missing my dentist. I'll just do a lap of here and go and wait for my dentist. Gonna head down now, get to the dentist. Right, see you on the other side. Well, there we go, hope you enjoyed that. Just out the wind now a little bit, and I'll show you the rest of that when I came out the dentist. Now, when I got the hat I showed you at the start of the video, I'll show you that tomorrow. Hope that's filled in a bit. Of bit of space in the video instead of me being blown away and complaining about the rain The other day just that bench was taped off now the uh, bench and the surrounding area has also been taped off it's like a crime scene so what's that about then eh what's to stop us walking past i wonder man okay 1914 bohemian band in timmouth that's the only information i've got and it's hard to even work out whereabouts they were. But I did state my local knowledge for some reason, even though it doesn't look exactly the same, that they were here on this corner, what's the San Juno Hotel and the uh, Regency Terrace. Here we go, 1914 Bohemian Band. Like I said, I really think it was about here anyway. I could be wrong, I could be wrong, but I think it was there, so that was what I'm going to go with. Right, out the wind now, slightly, and it goes to town cry to do something, lovely. Right, I wasn't going to go Liddles, and I was going to go up this way, but as I've seen the town cry heading in that direction, in full regalia, towards the triangle, you never know, there might be something going on there that needs my attention. So we go this way up to Liddles, still on the tail of the town crier. Get used to stalking soon. <laughs> Delightful light. There's a fountain. We've just overtaken the uh, town crier. Coasters. Oh, 
There's nothing actually going on in the triangle. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah, subscribe to Bill Phone Team, Muth. Well, there we go, see, it was worth tailing him. He started shouting. Lovely. Yeah, I didn't hear much of what he said. Again, it's the wind. It's hard to explain because I know I keep going on about it, but it's this, this wind blocker. When it works, it works. And um, it's really hard to pick things up. Just seen Andy and Chunker, but they're in deep conversation with a couple of people, so I didn't go and disturb them. Back of where the spoons were Barry. And we're actually on a quest now, Bickford Lane to Littles, for some yellow bananas. Now, not a nice staff, but every time I've gone to get the bananas, they've been so green, it's not been funny. And so you think, well, you know, put them on the windowsill, soon turn yellow, but they kind of don't, you know. They just sort of go to a, a, like a, a funny colour of green and sort of end up going mushy. So hopefully we're going to get some yellow bananas for Mum. She needs some fruit, she says. Fruit trifles aren't enough. <laughs> Finally, yellow nanas. All the others have been like that, but greener. Excellent. Woohoo! Should be pleased with them. Lovely. Yellow nanas, the simple things in life. So there we go. That wasn't too bad come the end, I don't think. Had part one in Newton Abbott, part two tomorrow. Couple of then and nows. Bit of a wander around, seeing what's going on. Uh, the town crier shouting at the top of his lungs. Lovely. Right, see you tomorrow for part two in Newton Abbott and another little mini wander. Take care. Bye.